Welcome back to the Upvote channel. What's the most awkward situation you've ever been in? Was unexpectedly in the car ride with my boyfriend's parents on their way to sign their divorce papers. When I was a kid, we were on holiday and decided to go to a church. While we were there, I decided that I would be funny if I would slap my dad's ass with both hands. So I ran in full speed to maximize the impact of the slap. I ended up slapping a stranger who also happened to walk next to a woman with a stroller in his hands, which made me think it was my dad. It was even worse that my parents saw it as well. Edit, because people are asking what happened afterwards. My parents just laughed at me, which made the guy laugh as well. And then we just left the church, I think. One time in college, I snuck into my RA's room and hid under the blanket on his top bunk. My goal was to scare him when he came in and settled down a bit. He ended up coming in with his girlfriend and began making out with her. After a good, lifetime, couple moments, I jumped up and ran out. No saving it. I was sitting in class, and the kid next to me farted and I said, God bless you as if it were a sneeze. Not awkward for me, but I was the reason for it. I served for a couple years and worked multiple restaurants in that time frame. I worked at a Denny's, night shift, best and worst job for many reasons. Anyways, there was a regular that came in often, drunk as a skunk and nasty as hell. He tipped really well, but was so nasty to us girls. It never fazed me so I served him often, he offered many many times to pay for extra service and tried to get me to leave with him often. Of course, I never did but a couple months later in working a new place, little more high end, I work mornings here, and this was a Sunday morning church rush. Guess who was sat in my section, my nasty regular from my last job with his entire family. His wife, kids, parents, the whole group, fresh out of church. The look on this man's face when I walked up and said hello. He was red as a fire truck, and I made it worse by asking if he remembered me. He left me a huge tip, probably because I didn't bring up his nasty mouth and grabby hands from his late drunken nights. Edit I was a waitress. That's what I meant by serving asterisk asterisk. Okay, I already posted in this thread, but I remembered something even worse. When I was in second grade, my brother and I would always be picked up after school by my dad. We had a green van with a red stripe on the side. So my brother grabs my hand and storms us up to the car. He rips open the door, sits us down, buckles me in, and then says, Can we get McDonald's on the way home? We both look up and there is two middle-aged adults sitting in the front seat that are obviously not our family. They stare at us, we stare at them. In my little brain, we've been staring at each other for at least 10 minutes at this point. My brother unbuckles me, unbuckles himself, we get out and walk away. No words were exchanged. We then checked who was in the car before getting in from that point forward. I was a teenager with a boner, pretty standard so far. I walked downstairs and had to tuck it in my pajamas so the head is sticking straight up and the erection is pinned against the body so the boner isn't noticeable. Well, when I put my t-shirt on it fell behind the tip, so if you looked at my ways at line, you could clearly see the tip of my penis. I was talking to my mom for a few minutes and she was flush red in the face and quickly trying to kill conversation not something my mom is known for. I walked away, saw what was going on, and didn't know what the hell to do. We never discussed it but because things were so awkward at dinner, I'm pretty sure my mom knew that I realized it happened as well. When I was a kid I hugged a random dude because I thought it was my dad. Even better how this dude's son was standing next to him. When I was a kid my family's then broke down, so we all had to squeeze into my dad's car to go to a funeral. Anyways, my older sister had to sit on my lap. 
Yep, you guessed it. I got a boner, and she freaked out and started screaming. Be sure to write in the comments what you think about it. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and watch our other videos.